Greetings everyone and welcome to Coffee Black, where the Voyager adventures continue on YouTube. I'm your host, Captain G, and this is the channel where you get your refill of everything Star Trek Voyager, including Trek trivia, news, reviews, and more. So before I get started on today's topic, I'd like to encourage new viewers to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Also check us out on X, formerly known as Twitter, and visit our Facebook page for additional Voyager content. So there's been a few updates about upcoming Star Trek projects over the last month, and honestly, I'm a little worried. It was recently announced that Picard producer and Voyager alumni Terry Metalis is going to work for Marvel doing a Vision series. And this is leading me to believe that if we get any kind of legacy series that was teased at the end of Season 3, it's going to be a very long time before we get it. Anyway, with all these latest talks about what Paramount is doing in the future, I thought I'd compile my own personal list of five Trek series that I think Paramount should make. The first series on my list is Star Trek Medical Emergency, a sci-fi medical drama based in the Star Trek universe. As I'm sure most people are aware, medical dramas usually gain a huge following, and there have been several long-running successful series such as House, ER, Grey's Anatomy, The Good Doctor, Chicago Med, New Amsterdam, just to name a few. Furthermore, there's already a high percentage of Star Trek episodes that revolve around some type of medical mystery or moral obstacle, so really all this series would do is recycle that format, but in a more focused setting. A series like this would be perfect for introducing new characters, while also having potential to bring back famous Star Trek Doctors like Bashir or Voyager's EMH. Best of all, a series like this could help pull in new viewership while still being written for all fans of Star Trek. Personally, if Paramount announced a Trek medical series headlining Robert Picardo as the Chief Medical Officer on a Special Emergency Medical Starbase, I'd be ecstatic. The next series is a no-brainer, and probably the more popular option, and that's Star Trek Legacy, chronicling the adventures of Captain Seven and her crew aboard the USS Enterprise G. Their series would be the next logical step for Star Trek, breaking new ground with beloved characters both new and reoccurring. The next series won't surprise too many of my subscribers, but it needs to be said, we need a Star Trek Janeway series. There's so much potential to use a Janeway series to bridge the gap between Voyager's End and Picard's final season. To a degree, we've gotten a taste of that with the beloved animated series Star Trek Prodigy, but that series is more focused on building of newer, younger characters with Voyager-related cameos sprinkled in. I'm so passionate for this series concept, I've even written a series pilot. I just need someone at Paramount to give me five minutes of their time to allow me to pitch it. Heck, if I was Paramount's next Berman or Kurtzman, I'd probably shock the world and bring back Voyager for an eighth season, continuing the adventures on a Voyager A or B. That's not on my list though, but hey, a guy can dream, right? Now before listing my last two series, I want to make it known I'm not a huge fan of prequels, and I think diving back into the past is holding Star Trek back as a franchise. But that said, I still think that these two next series ideas would be fantastic. The next series is The House of Kalos. Fans have long asked for a Klingon-focused series, and I think a series revolving around their greatest warrior, with a series writing style similar to that of, say, Game of Thrones, Spartacus, or more recently, Shogun, would have the huge potential to become a popular series and bring glory to the Empire. And finally, I think it would be a great idea to have a Borg origin series. Now, obviously, a series diving into how the Borg came to be might not last two to seven seasons, but I think the concept would make a great one-shot series or even a mini-series, discovering the mystery behind how the greatest villains of Star Trek came to be. Were they always technology-focused? Did they always seek to be telepathically linked? There's so much potential there for creatively, especially if they added a time travel element to the series. But now I want to hear what you guys think. Leave a comment in the comment section below. Let me know which of these ideas you like the most. I'll probably do a poll on the channel after I upload this video to see which one is the most liked. And I also want to hear your original ideas. What type of Star Trek series do you want to see in the future? 
That is all I have for you all today. This has been Captain G of Coffee Black with your refill of everything Star Trek Voyager. Thank you for watching. Take care. Live long and prosper.